Officer Matthews, I've got a 1010 in progress. 1452 Lewis Avenue. I'm gonna need backup. All backup available. It's gonna be all right. On the ground. Oh my goodness, we're back. Okay, update time. You heard back from Jen yet? Um, no. I'm sure she'll reply at some point. Let me take a look at the situation. Hey, Jen, you going to the party tonight? Dude, we talked about this. <laughs> Could you have any less game? I'm no good at this. Ooh, how about... Yo, Jen, see you at the party. Let me know if I should bring handcuffs. <laughs> what? Oh my god, you thirsty bitch. The heck? Here, let Lila the Love Witch work her magic. Okay, just don't make me sound like a loser. I said matchmaker, not miracle worker. Hey, hold on. Let me check it before you send. Too late. Would be awesome to see you there. What? I could have texted that. It's a good start. She'll text back, you'll see. You know, I don't even know if I want to go tonight. Oh, please. It's gonna be fun. You hate every party. Oh, because they're all the same. Too many people, too fucking loud, everybody's wasted. Yes, Sean, you just described a party. Well, the suspense is killing me. It's Dad. He wants to know if I'm coming home after school. <sighs> Jeez, I'm not a ten-year-old. He just cares about you, Sean. Anyway, you should be happy your dad's looking out for you. Oh, it's Jen saying she can't wait to see us at the party. What? Really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Told you I would work my matchmaker magic. Hmm. So, so what should I wear tonight? A condom. Oh, ha ha. Paying plenty of attention in sex ed class, I see. Hey, lovebirds. Back from the loony bin? Shut the fuck up, dickhead. <laughs> Damn, your neighbor's an asshole. Yep. Always true to himself.
Man, we need to find a couch for your yard one day. <sighs> Ooh, careful. Last time my dad almost busted me out here. Because you were alone? Your dad wouldn't bust me. He loves me. So, you want to hit or not? Oh shoot. Which I do. Uh... Smoking bath. Mm. Nah. Maybe at the party. Track stars aren't supposed to smoke, you know? Yeah, sure. I'll remember this when you're begging for a spliff tonight. Speaking of weed, I got that covered tonight. What else do we need? Eric said his parents don't leave shit at the cabin, so we better make an official party list. Hey, whoa, what the hell are you don't doing? Don't move. You're my human post-it note. First, we need money for supplies, munchies, chips and dip, soda, etc. Uh, this better wash off. And of course, we must not forget the booze. I can probably snag a six pack from dad if he's got enough. Hey, did you ever think of maybe just sending a text instead? <laughs> hmm. All right, blankets. It's gonna get so chilly tonight. You and Jen are gonna need something to snuggle under. Oh, one last thing. C O N D. Oh. oh, stop. You're out of room, punk. Whoa, good, good drawing, Lila. Daniel's teacher would be proud of you. Ha! The pretentious artist has spoken. Don't fall asleep before me tonight, or you might see more of my skills. <laughs> you wish. Plane. Oh, these fucking planes, man. I want to hate them, but... I'll miss them so much if I move somewhere else. Shit changes so fast. I get so emo sometimes, wondering what will happen to us once we graduate. Will you still be my BFF? Will shit ever get better than 1452 Lame Avenue? Yeah, man. Or be friends. Friends forever. Yeah, but what happens if we go to different colleges? Or you get sick of me? Whatever. Um, you have you actually? heard of the internet? <laughs> no way distance can tear us apart. We're freaking fighters. Yeah, you're right. Best freaking fighters forever. Okay, it's getting way late and I gotta pick out my outfit for tonight. Skype me later when you're ready. Hugs. Talk to you soon. Hello, Friday night. <laughs> hey, perfect timing. Just the sun I wanted to see. Oh, sure, but I'm a little busy. Did you see Lila? She said we can go to the movies next week. She said- Dude, bug her, not me. You're not exactly her type. You're lucky she puts up with you. Ugh, jeez. Thanks, Pop. I feel really supported right now. You're welcome. And now we need an objective judge. That would be you. <gasps> really? Hey, no shh, fair. Shh, shh, shh. Court is in session. Judge Diaz presiding over the case of the last Choco Crisp. I... I have to go, uh... Get ready for a party and stuff. So, well, if you want to attend to a party and stuff, you have to earn it, Your Honor. Oh, shit. Hey, he swore. Yes, I heard Tattletale. Mm. Please, Judge Diaz, be an example to the court and society. Then you can go hook up or chill or whatever. Now, who deserves to eat this final choco crisp? Your adorable little brother who eats about 10 bags a week. Or your poor, suffering father who slaves over a hot engine to provide his family with a home and a garage. Me, me, me. Come on. 
on, Judge. Shh, 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 shh. Let him decide. Judge, the verdict, please. We use control. Okay. And let's see. Uh, give it to Dad. Let's go. Daniel was guilty of being a brat, so the Choco Crisp goes to Senor Diaz. What? No way. You're a cheat. <laughs> nope. I'm the law. Your Honor, I can't let you punish an innocent I man. Do. So? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I always knew you'd confess. Okay, back to work. I hear an engine calling my name. My name is Keyboard Mouse. And you better play nice together, like you always do. I have to go to work in my room, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah? Don't hurry back. <sighs> OK. Let's get this party list started. I should listen. Use control. Yeah. Take it. Soda. This will work. I don't want to get wasted in front of Jen. Look at the cookie dough. <laughs> Man, Daniel could live off this crap. Okay, better take that instead. Yeah. So you put it in your back pocket. Got that. Cross that off the list. Drinks here? down, food to go. Let's see, the Let's see the chips. Hope there's also like real food at this party. No candy. Okay, we got chippos. Morning, sir. What the? Is dad? Baking something? You ready for the party yet? Damn. Lila's so hyped up for... Dad tries so hard to get on a healthy diet. I can't wait for him to be on Instagram. My room. That's Very funny, Lila. Good thing my boss. Sorry, Lila. Okay. Don't. Man, this is taking forever. Do they want me to pay for it? Oh my god. The internet was a mistake. You must. Oh, Diaz, I hear you gonna. What the? Asshole. Damn. I still have like 10 books left in the series. I won't finish until I'm 20. Like this. <sighs> Not sure Daniel was ready to be an uncle yet. Time to get in the mood for tonight. What music is this? From the point he gave Sorry, Lila. I'm just not a selfies kind of guy. Oh my god. The internet was a mistake. What are you doing now? Somewhere the line, a girl in the world is just waiting for a boy. Where do we go? Nah, I guess we go. All right, Dad. Where do you put the blankets? Where's the blankets? How long is he gonna keep all this shit? Where's the blanket is? Oh, there it is. 
Oh, I do like Thank God I don't have to take one of Daniel's. I'm sure Dad won't miss one blanket for the night. Well, doing Bet you, Sean? Yeah. Yeah. Don't get too excited, kid. You're making me nervous. Hey. Since you're creeping around up there, can you pass me the wrench in the top red floor? Do. Um, there's no wrench here. Ah, uh, shoot, must be somewhere else then. Take a look around. I know I left it nearby. It's a 16 millimeter reversible flex wrench. Jeez, that was definitely my plan for tonight. So, yeah. Hold on. That's not it. Sam came by the garage today. Told me to tell you hi for him. How's his leg? Well, you know, old fossils like us don't heal the way you do. Exterior. Uh, remind me never to get old. Hey, it beats the alternative. Hey, I got it. I think. Nah. I need one with the black switch on it, so I can change its direction. Oh, I picked the wrong one, I guess. Is this one? Hey, did you get your English? Here you go. Hmm, wrong size. I need oh a 16 God. millimeter. No. Oh, here we go, this one. It was this one, dog. Is that it? Yes. There you this go. is it. Took your time about it, but you did it. I'll make a grease monkey out of you. Yeah, yeah. All right, just let me tighten this. So, finally decided to come and join your old man under the hood, huh? <laughs> yeah, um, sure. I know it's not your thing, but you gotta learn a trade, art. Athletics, engineering, I don't care. As long as you put your heart into it. Try. I'm trying. I just don't know what direction to go. You're only 16 years old. You've got time to figure it out. Trust me, it took me a while too. And are you happy with it? I mean, your job, living here? Of course I am. We're doing great. Maybe one day when I retire, I'll go back to Mexico, to Puerto Lobos. But until then... Ugh, I've heard this one before. Hmm. I don't even know why I'm fixing you a sweet car for graduation. Ugh, come on. It's wicked. I'm just not used to driving. You better get used to it, or you'll be taking your date to prom on the number 30 bus. <laughs> like I'm going on tons of dates. Not when Daniel's cock-blocking me the whole time. He's nine. He doesn't even know what cock-blocking is. He looks up to you, Jean. Try and help him. It's what family is for. Things are kind of scary out there in this country right now. Yeah. Oh, um... By the way... Ha! I was wondering how long it'd take. You need money for the party tonight, right? Ah, 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 shh. Just be honest with me. No bullshit. Are you using this money to buy alcohol? Weed? Um, I mean... Yeah, probably. But we'll be partying at a house and nobody's driving home. 
I swear. Well, everybody's got to get home somehow. But yeah, you and Lila better not get in any car with somebody who can't walk straight. Holy shit, 40 bucks? Really? Yeah, why not? You did a good job on the lock. Plus, I appreciate that you didn't lie to me. Thanks, Dad. Thanks, Just be Dad. Careful. That's all I'm asking for, okay? I know what kind of crazy shit kids can get into. When you were my age, did you party a lot? <laughs> Sorry. What happens in Mexico stays in Mexico. Now get out of here before I change my mind about that cash. And keep an eye on Daniel while you're home, would you? All right. Thanks, Dad. Hey, hey, hey. Not so fast, Shawnee boy. Don't you think your papito deserves a hug? Okay. Uh, okay, have fun. But not too much. I won't. Promise. Bye. Love ya. I love you too, hijo. I bet Dad had a pretty wild teenagehood. Even though he won't tell. <sighs> Looks like I got everything. Better pack it all up. Well, pack it all up. Let's go. Yeah, pack it in here. Or... Finally, ready to go. Time to Skype Lila on my laptop. Okay. Sorry, Lila. I'm just... boy just give me a minute gee where did I put the mm, hold on <laughs> okay hi did you get everything on your hand list it's all in my backpack yeah dad hooked me up with some cash so we're set for the night in case we need anything else or if you and Jen need anything else Ooh la la. <sighs> okay serious talk what are you gonna say to Jen tonight I don't know Whatever. Do I need to practice? I've seen you in action. Yes. You're totally into her, right? Duh. Why do you think I'm freaking out? She's so super cool. You're super cute. Just be yourself. That's why she's Sean. into you. Sean! I'm done, look! I made zombie blood. It's um, corn syrup and food coloring. Hey. Hi, Lila. Get out of my room, Daniel. I was just... Come on, man. Just uh, Just bugging the uh, shit out of me uh, again after I told you to knock? Uh, yeah, but... I know. Anyway. Sean, you're an asshole. What's your problem? But... I want to see zombie blood if you don't. <sighs> sorry, sorry. I'll make it up to him. He knows I can be a dick. I'm just stressed out about tonight. No, oh, please. We're gonna have so much fun. Maybe tonight's the night. Don't jinx me. Jinx? I'm your lucky charm, bitch. <laughs> okay. So when are you coming over? I just have to hit up the momster for the car keys and hope she doesn't make me lie too much about the party. I'm already in trouble from last time. Hey, are you listening to me? Um, you know something called Multitasking? That's a girl thing, no? 
Let me see that drawing. This might be my masterpiece. Well, yeah. It's my portrait. Oh shit. Jen just posted her outfit for tonight. What? On her wall. You should check it up. It might get your attention. Check it. Whoa. Her hair. Whoa, indeed. I told you she was super into you, man. What's her profile picture got to do with me? Huh, you will see. OMG, you gave her an LOL? <laughs> that is a ballsy move. So what? I'm a funny guy. Are you? I better warn her. Hold on, okay? Something's going on outside. What do you mean? Hey! Look at my shirt, asshole! What's the big deal? It's Halloween! Uh, hey! Don't ever touch my brother! You hear me, Brett? Fuck you, Diaz. He got his fake blood shit all over my shirt. Look! I told you, it was an accident! You better leave us alone! Oh yeah, go hide in your dad's garage. Pussies. You think you own the block? Oh shoot. This is uh So we have to question Daniel. Dude, did you get that blood on him? Uh it was it was an accident. I swear. He's a fucking retard. See what happens when you don't listen? Dad oh, told you to stay in the yard. I know, I know, Sean. I was just acting like a zombie and I forgot. I swear. I swear. Where? Take the little baby back to his crib. Come on, Daniel. We're done. Yeah, go back to daddy. Pussies. No wonder your mom bailed on you. Oh, now this is... <laughs> I knew it was gonna happen. Whoa! Sean, you hit him! Get inside, now! Sean! You're dead meat, bitch! <gasps> oh, shoot. <sighs> oh, left hand. You and whole fucking family are going to jail, losers! Oh, that rock hit him. Oh, What's going fuck on? me! Daniel, get over here! Sean, is he hurt? Okay, okay, step away. Now! Calm down, officer! Shut up! And step back! <laughs> on the ground! Now! Hey, wait! This guy was he started beating it. up my little on the brother! Ground. Now, hands behind your Sean. head. This is fucking bullshit. Oh no. Sean, what's Get happening? Sean, Dad, we didn't do Sean, anything. Sean, be quiet. I swear. Officer, Sean, listen. Oh. I'm sorry, Dad. Daddy, be quiet. I go home. They're good kids, officer. Don't move. I'm sure they didn't do I anything. I said don't move. We didn't Daniel, do anything. It's gonna be all right. On the ground. Oh my God.
Start a basic game that highlights player choice, your action decisions will have consequences that impact the world around you and your brother. Choose wisely. Near Mount Rainier, Washington, two days later. Alright, India, for this episode, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.